What materials am I looking for? Let's see. Uh, is that it? Nope. Box. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think I got slime spike. Or the one that I was missing while I was off screen. And I did sell it. I think I did. I hope I did. Because if I did, I can I just have buy the it. Best Okay, uh, haha, -ha, look at that. I have none stock, none stock. So I need four of each, I think. Four of those. Four of those. You honor us with your patronage. Please tell your friends. Okay, let's go. Let's give this to, yeah, that guy. Here are those materials you asked for, Fail. Nice. Great! Here's your payment. If you're willing, I could use your help again. Those hides you provided worked out great. But I'd like to reinforce their armor with materials from those hulking giants out there. If you could bring two giant rocks and two giant cores, we'd be all set. I'll pay you way more than you'd get by selling it to the shopkeeper. I think I can do that. Slow, let's go. I have the. I might be able to do that. Um, let's see. Two giant cores. And two giant rocks. Thank, ah. thank you for coming in. I wonder if I can get this, uh, if I have enough material to get this quest done. Flight. That would be awesome. Here are those materials you asked for, Fail. Great! Here's your payment. If you're willing, I could use your help again. Those reinforcements really help strengthen the guard's armor. But now it's a bit too rigid. I'd like to add some flexibility using a few materials you can only find on flying pink ovies. Let me see. Uh... Six RV wings and six RV claws to do the trick. I'll pay you for the work, of course. Okay, let's actually, before I do that, let's see if I actually have them. No, I don't even have one RV. <laughs> let's go. I have the best selection. I'm pretty sure I gave the merchant though, so he should have some. Yep. Six of those. Six of those. Thank you for coming. Thank you. And there we go. <laughs> nice. Well, like I said before, I wonder how far I can get it. If I can get Here are those done materials you asked for, Fail. Great! Here's your payment. If you're willing, I could use your help again. More. I've got one last job for you, Dust. Aha. There's a strange flying creature called a Florn that lives around these parts. Can shoot balls of electricity from its tentacles. A real nasty customer. If you could gather three Florn tentacles and three Florn sparks, I can use them to reinforce our guards' armor and give their weapons a bit of an extra kick. I'll pay a premium for them that you won't get from the shops around here. Nice. I think I do have that material, so we might actually be able to get this quest done. Yes! Awesome. Welcome back. Um... Hmm... Okay, let's see. Haha, -ha, I do. Uh... Three, I think you need. You. Ha 
Aha! And now we can get this quest done. Hopefully you need three. I think it was three. Here are those materials yep. you asked for. Aha! Thing. Done. Great! Here's your payment. I think that's it. I have everything I need thanks to you. Complete. Nice. <laughs> awesome. Um no need to go give that guy his box. And that will well we'll just leave that and I'll bring, or he'll tell you. There we go. You found it! Quickly, give it to me! Relax, Reed. It's just a box. Just a box? No! No, it's not just a box. Didn't you hear it whispering to you? The whispers. The lies. I'll say. They told me the box was filled with cupcakes. I opened it up and nothing was inside. Oh! Oh, no, 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 you opened the box! Why did you open the box? I told you not to open the box! Quick, take it back! I can't hold this! Hey, what are you doing? I thought you wanted your box back. I went through a lot of trouble getting that. Yeah, we had to find this girl in Mudpa and then make her a doll that looked like me, then trade the doll for the box. Honestly, it was a bit roundabout. Do you know what you've done? You've unleashed the power inside this ancient prison, and now it will consume your very soul. Well, okay, that's crazy. Okay, Reed, I really think it's time you went inside and got some sleep. I think... Wait. What's happening to me? There's something... something wrong with me! Reed, what was that? What's going on? I feel... I feel... weak. Like something's sucking the life right out of my body. Then it's already started. Oh, why did you have to open the box? I said not to open the box! Look, let's not dwell on the whole who opened the box thing. The box was open. That's in the past. We can't change that. We should be focusing on the future, and, you know, less about me. The presence inside this box, it latches onto your soul, tries to take over your mind. The only way to stop it is to break the barrier between body and soul. In other words, Dust, you will need to kill yourself. Reed! <laughs> it really is the only way, Dust. You mustn't take too long, or, or you could end up like me. You know what? I love this plan. I'm happy to be a part of it. Shut up, Fidget! I can feel my life draining away every moment. Reed, what do I have to do? Travel outside the village, pick a fight with some monsters, and lose. If you do it in time, the presence latched onto your soul will be shaken loose and returned to the box, and you will return back to your normal self. That is, assuming you do it in time. Just, you can't seriously be considering. Fidget, I don't have time to argue. I can feel it draining my life away. We need to get out of the village and fast. Okay, let's go. Oh my god. Come on. That's the only thing. Is if you're trying to go quickly, uh, when it damages you, you get knocked back and it's really annoying. Well, yeah, I don't really get that. I didn't open the box. Fidget did, so why is this not happening to Fidget? Why is it happening to me? It's kind of annoying. Uh, where should I go? I should go... Here. Why not? Go here. Hey! Hey, ow! Come on, kill me. Kill me, please. Just kill me. These guys are so weak. Uh, kill me, please. I should have gone somewhere that was a head stronger. Because I'm just... Uh, kill me, please. Every time I jump, if I get damage, I get knocked back. It's really annoying. Come on. I'm just trying to find my enemy. There. Now I have all these freaking enemies. Just please. 
How am I killing them? I'm not even press. I'm not even holding my controller. Yeah, I'm slicing them with my sword, but I'm not even holding my controller. What the fuck? How am I doing that? Attack me! You asses! Oh my god, this is really annoying. Attack me! I'm not even attacking them, I'm not sure why they're dying. It's really annoying. There. Right? There we go. Okay. Did that do it? Are you okay now? I think so. <sighs> yeah. As soon as I took that killing blow, I felt something. Like a weight lifted. We should check in with Reed. Yeah. The sooner you get rid of that box, the better. Don't open it again, Bridget. And then I'll be perfectly fine. Flying thing, get down here. Why are you up there? You died. You died too. I hear, like I said, I should have gone somewhere with stronger. Oh my God. God, thank you. Now let's give this back to Reed. Do, 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 do. Somehow that killing blow managed to shake the presence free. I'm back to my normal self again. I'm glad that's the case. Anyway, I was planning on using this revival stone on you if my plan didn't work, but it should still serve as an adequate reward. Wait, what do you mean if your plan didn't work? Well, it did, didn't it? So now I have no use for this revival stone, and you can take it. Hopefully you'll never have to use it. Yes, well, you keep that box under lock and key. We're just lucky that kid down in Mudpot had the common sense not to open it. I will never let it out of my sight again. It's my burden to bear, after all. Good luck, Dust. What else whispers to me? No. No, it can't be. The trees? The trees themselves whisper an ancient song! Somebody must chop them all down to silence their lies! Goodbye, Reed. Bye. Crazy. Well, I guess you was really crazy. Bob. Uh, I would say that um, mission is probably one of my least 